Now in this question, we have to find out the restriction enzyme which produces blunt ends. Now for these four restriction enzymes mentioned here, these are their restriction sites and if in the restriction site the phosphodiester bond is cut away from the center there would be staggered ends or the flush ends. So if we see for sal 1 the enzyme cuts between G and A. So there will be this much part will be unpaired so that would be flush end. For eco R5 the cut is in between. So here these two ends will be equal. In XHO1 here it is between C and T and in Hindi 3 it is between the two adenines here. So in this case we can see that these three enzymes are producing flush ends while eco R5 is producing blunt end. So our answer is option number 2. And with this we can move on to question 129. Now in this question what kind of therapy was given in 1990 to this 4 year old girl having ADA deficiency and ADA deficiency is a condition of a disease that is SCID that is severe combined immunodeficiency which is a rare kind of genetic disorder due to deletion in the chromosome number 20 and this enzyme adenosine deaminase is not formed. So in this case the correct copy of the ADA gene was introduced into the T cells and they were then uh, infused back into the body. So such kind of treatment is called gene therapy where a deleterious gene is substituted by the correct copy of the gene. While the remaining three terms chemotherapy, immunotherapy and radiation therapy these are for cancer treatment. So these are for treatment of cancer. So how here our correct answer is option number 1. So let us move on to question 130.